cook on Sunday. Eat till Thursday. I'm Allie. And I'm Daniel. And this is Economy Bites. Economy um, Bites is a, is a triple entendre, I, I think. We try and stick between the 20 to $30 range, depending on how long the meal's going to last. Ready? Okay, so today we're going to be making a chicken with a creamy mushroom sauce. Well, we both graduated from Oberlin College in 2007. Um, I'm from Texas, and I moved to New York just to have an adventure. I just came to New York looking to get production jobs and had a few internships. I was looking for other, like, creative outlets, you know, because my job my day-to-day -day life was kind of boring. I was watching a lot of food TV and I realized that there wasn't really anything out there for people our age who are just cooking for one olive oil, just for a little flavor. Web television is apparently the future. People have short attention spans. It's not about a dinner party. It's not about cooking for your family. It's just about being able to feed yourself. Mm. The big goal of the show in terms of the food is to like demystify the kitchen. You can cook at the level in which you're comfortable and I am comfortable with mess. I'm comfortable with dirt. I, you know, I feel like a little dirt never hurt and I think when people watch me do it, they say she cooks the way I cook, like she drops things. Whoops. She doesn't know how to chop an onion. She might burn something occasionally. Oh my god, that's fucking gross. Remember earlier when I was like, something smells like it's cooking. Sorry guys, excuse me. That's so f***ing gross. Or she <laughs> doesn't have all the tools and all the gadgets. This is the really fun part of this recipe. But I go to my local grocery store and I pick up the groceries just the way everybody else does. And I do it in my actual kitchen just the way everybody else does. Starting to sweat here. One of the ways we got lucky in this is sort of utilizing all of our underemployed friends. Uh, for instance, we got, you know, our friend Seth to write a score for the show, which he donated for free because he had some extra time. You know, maybe the recession set the stage for this type of collaboration, and we've been lucky to be able to take advantage of it. She we didn't have any startup capital. We didn't find an investor. So we're just going to cook the mushrooms in this already hot butter. Five yeah. or ten years ago, you know, we would need $100,000 maybe to do something like this. It sounds ridiculous now, but it's really true. We have some that cost 10, you know, but the real, my real limit that I never want to go over is 30. These are just facts of life that you, especially living in New York City, being a young person, but even not being a young person, just have enough money to pay the rent and buy their food. And so uh, you don't really have any choice about being on a budget. You have to be on a budget. People always need, need to live on a budget. So to learn how to manage that uh, at whatever age, you know, is something that is going to be beneficial forever. It actually tastes better than I remember it tasting. Oh wow, and the sauce is really good. Mm.